What is up you guys? Welcome to the part 3 of our Worship Keys series. And in this video, I'm going to teach you the chord progression called 654. It's a decreasing chord progression, but it sure is increasing your ability to play worship keys better in church. <laughs> this is how it sounds like everybody. I love this chord progression. It makes you want to bounce. And if you want to learn this with me, <laughs> Check the video out in 3, 2, 1, let's go! Alright, so this is the chord progression. It's called 6, 5, 4. Again, we are in the key of C. And of course, hindi yun yung groove na gagamitin natin sa God, you're so good. That's for another service. <laughs> but um, here's the chord progression. It's called 6, 5, 4. So again, our scale is in the key of C. And our chords are 6, 5, 4. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So that's an A minor. And then this is a G right here. That's number 5. And then 4 right here is... Okay. So, eto. 6, 5, 4. Now, let me show you how it sounds like using the chord progression or using it as free worship chords for God, You're So Good. God, you're so good. think of it as you know 654 because it's easier to communicate to the band na, oh ito yung chord progression natin that's a 6 5 and then 4 so that 6 5 4 that 5 is a chord na kasali talaga sa chord progression so it all depends i like i like to call this 6 5 4 but um it sure is fun so 6 5 and 4 Back to God, you're so good. Here it is. One, two, chorus. And God, you're so good. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. You're so good. All right, free worship, everybody. Let's go in six, five, four, six. Five, four, five, four, God, you're so good. Yeah. One more time and six, five, four. Then you'll go back to God, you're so good. Thank him for this chord, 654. <laughs> now, let's go to the mid-tempo, the one that I did in the intro, you know. Let's go to that right there because this is something that I really use during our um, mid-tempo, groovy kind of jamming type of worship keys and playing sa band namin. So, let's play the beat and let's go. At one, two. Let's go. At one, two. So that is how it sounds like. Let me break it down to you. What are the chords I use here? And these are some bonus. In the last video, I talked about the A minor 7, right? But in this video, I will teach you the older brother of the A minor 7, which is called the A minor 9. <laughs> <laughs> 
this actually goes to even up until 13 pero in this case nine lang muna tayo because most of the time you know in church or in this kinds of music that we are playing worship keys you know nine yung pinaka siguro extended na, na ginagamit sa church sound or at least the songs that we play in church we stopped playing Israel a new breed a long time ago <laughs> going back going back I miss Israel songs but going back here is the A minor nine you know Ayon. That is how it looks like. So how do you construct an A minor 9 chord? So here it is. Yung A minor 7 natin from the last video, ito yung itsura niya, right? Okay. Alright? So this is how you construct an A minor 9. This is an A minor 9 chord. May 9 siya dito. In this video, I'm gonna show you what it looks like first. And then, so siguro I'm just gonna make another video on this. On how to construct chords because kung may chord charts tayo or whatever we have there. Yung pinaka-struggle dyan is how do you actually play the chord chart. Especially if may mga extensions na ganito. So I'm gonna make a separate video on that. If you like that idea, then click the like button below or comment down below. Go for it, Kyle. Let's go and make chords. <laughs> and we will make that video come to reality. But this is how an A minor 9 looks like. But in this case, etong... 9, tsaka itong 7, 2 of these, etong dalawa, inoctave lang natin dito sa baba. So, ito yung 7, tapos ito yung 9. Tama? And then, of course, eto, alright? 7, eto yung 9. So, right there. And then, we omit the 1. Inomit lang natin para mas, mag mas madali sa atin. So, that's how it sounds like. A regular A minor sounds like this. An A minor 9 sounds like this. Right? It sounds better. Right. Compared sa That sounds basic, pero kung ito, right there. Yeah, that's an A minor 9 right there. So that's the 6th chord. Let's go to the 5. It's a regular G. In this case, again, G suspended 2 and then the F. Now in the F, I use an F major 9 chord. So 9 ulit, di ba? Right there. Again, same thing. Uh, parang, yeah, you, you, look at the, you look at how it looks like, you know? Look at the A minor 9. Right? May ganito, and then A minor 9 and F. It looks the same. Actually, the fingering neto is just like that. The transfer mo lang siya. And you guys, have fun with this chord progression. Hey! you know chord progression again click the like button below share this with your friends and of course if you are new to this channel then don't forget to lay your hands on the subscribe button so that you won't miss any video that i'll be posting soon and very soon worship keys series is still on fire ladies and gentlemen if you want more comment them down below what kinds of chord progression you want to hear this is kyle of church on a budget ph that aims to help churches become efficient and effective see you on the next video and peace peace peace, peace. Thank mm -hmm. you.